everyone, I'm Lauren Havlin for NCDOT Now. The North Carolina Department of Transportation is continuing to host outreach events for small, women-owned and minority-owned businesses. The quarterly events for disadvantaged business enterprises ensure these businesses are aware of how to compete for state transportation contracting opportunities. Contracts are available in many areas, including construction and maintenance, mowing, litter pickup, tree cutting, emergency work, and snow and ice removal. We need more partners to help us to uh, maintain and to grow and expand our uh, infrastructure. Having those participants, those contractors come in and help us just helps our system overall. We want to make sure that the playing field is fair for everyone, so that's why it's really important that if you're interested in being a subcontractor or a prime, or um, if you already one and not certified, it's important that you come to the outreaches. Well, I think it's important for networking, you know, maybe uh, getting together with other contractors and seeing what we could do together to help the DOT. NCDOT recently held outreach meetings in half of its divisions and is hosting meetings across the rest of the state on February 19th. For more information, visit NCDOT's DBE Outreach website. Skip the roses and the chocolates this Valentine's Day because NC Buy Train is offering buy one, get one free tickets. The sale is running February 9th through the 16th and tickets are valid for travel from March 1st to August 31st. To buy tickets, visit ncbytrain.org. Finally, last weekend, the University of North Carolina Chapel Hill recognized two of its former basketball coaches after two sections of Interstate 40 were named in their honor. NCDOT placed honorary signs designating the stretch between mile marker 270 and 273 as Dean Smith Highway and between mile markers 266 and 270 as Roy Williams Highway. Thanks for joining us for NCDOT Now. We'll see you next time.